It is I, Brickule. Get some cat hair off there. I hope you like construction vehicles, because I build a lot of them. You know, I'll be driving down the highway, and I'll see one, and I'll think, I should build that. But yeah, here's a neat little crane truck. Pretty, uh, pretty simple build, really, but I like how it turned out. And I need video content, so I'm showing you everything. But hey, that's why you're here. And it's all fun. It's Lego. So let's take a look. It's a nice size, too. It's pretty big. Got, uh, little outriggers you can pull out. You can actually deploy them using uh, Technic pins. They click in the retracted position. Then you can push them down. And they click into the deployed position. I am pretty happy with how that turned out. I will probably use that on some more builds later. It just adds a bit of playability. It doesn't, quite, it doesn't necessarily look super accurate, but it is fun. So you see, it is deployed. Let's stop this spinning. The crane uh, is more for display, this piece. I need to figure out a better way to adjust this. But the little piston here, when you try to raise it, it kind of just disconnects. I need some different parts for that. But it is very stiff, which means it lets me pose it uh, when it's in a, a layout. Oh, let's zoom out a bit. Oh, I guess you'll see the edge of my uh, studio. I'm starting to need a bigger uh, photo box. But yeah, let you, since it's stiff, it holds it really good. You can extend the arm. And then you can pull the string out. And I'll bump the camera. And we'll adjust the camera. There we go, that's better. So you can uh, put your some kind of crane payload up there. Like a supply pallet. If you want to ignore OSHA, you can put your dudes up there too full 360 rotation pretty uh, pretty straightforward got a little cab got a little uh, control indicator so you're gonna keep an eye on it got a little spotlight Emmett's in there driving he looks super happy who would not be happy driving a big crane you just got a seat for one guy and a couple of little uh, control joysticks. You got some exhaust there, and then you got the uh, the winch, so you can pull that back in. Got a caution sign there, adds a bit of interest and detail. That is a code from... Exoforce. Pretty sure I used that code already, don't bother with it. Uh, yeah, kind of big construction industrial truck here. We got uh, turn signals, we got some spotlight, or not spotlights, headlights. They're a little close together, but I am happy with how it turned out. Got that uh, nice grill there. I gotta find some more of those pieces. Mirrors, window wipers, cause you know me, I like to include those kind of details. Got the fuel tanks under the doors. You got a bit of storage space for some tools. Doors. This pops off. Ugh. You can fit two minifigs in here if you uh, do it right. Not really much detail on the inside. You just got a steering wheel in there. And it fits one minifig. One burly, strong construction man. And then we got this old uh, piece from a, I think that was a racing truck 
from the 90s. That was a good set. But I just uh, needed something to fill in there, and I like using printed pieces wherever I can. Especially if there's Octan, which is good for LEGO City. So yeah, that is my crane truck. Hope you like it. I like building construction vehicles, they're fun. There's usually a couple construction areas in my LEGO display for the city. Thanks for watching. Stay tuned for some more vehicles, mostly construction vehicles, uh, coming up next. And I'll see you to the next video.